Hi everyone, welcome to my vegetarian kitchen. Today's recipe combines two classics that everyone loves, cheese and pasta. And this creamy borzen pasta with sun-dried tomatoes, spinach, mushrooms and cherry tomatoes is a dream come true for all you pasta lovers. So whether you're hosting a dinner party or just craving a satisfying meal that's simply out of the world, then this dish promises to impress with its easy prep and incredible taste. Let's dive right in. We're going to start off by placing cherry tomatoes, chopped garlic into a baking dish, drizzle some olive oil, some salt to taste, chili flakes and oregano. Now I'm using Borzen Urban Garlic Cheese for this recipe that's really going to be the star of the show. A very mild tasting cheese that is soft, fluffy and melts beautifully. Unwrap the Borzen cheese and place it in the center of the dish surrounded by other ingredients. Add in some sun-dried tomatoes. These little gems will add a savory depth to our dish and we're gonna bake it all in the oven for about 25 to 30 minutes at 375 degrees. While that bakes, let's get the pasta ready. Heat water in a large pot to boiling. Generously salt the water and add some oil. Now add in your favorite pasta and cook according to package instructions. Once done, drain and keep it aside. While the pasta cooks, let's get the sauce going. Heat olive oil in a skillet over medium heat. Add in some chopped shallots and garlic. Saute for about two to three minutes until translucent and slightly brown. We're gonna add in the mushrooms and saute for another three to four minutes until the mushrooms have released their liquid and start to turn slightly golden. Add in some heavy cream along with some fresh spinach. We're gonna put the lid on and allow the spinach to wilt. This should take no more than a minute. Our cheese and tomatoes have baked to perfection. With a fork, mash the cheese and tomatoes until it forms a chunky sauce. I like to keep it a little on the chunkier side, but you can mash it as much as you like. We're gonna give it all a good mix. Our spinach is done. It's now time to pour the prepared cheese sauce into the skillet. Mix well. Add in the cooked pasta. Toss to combine. Check for seasoning if you'd like. Turn the stove off. Garnish with some fresh basil leaves and serve it immediately. This is a meal I make for my family and friends time and time again. So delicious and garlicky, it tastes absolutely phenomenal. Like, follow and subscribe for more such recipes and remember to click on the bell icon to get new video updates. Thanks for watching. Happy cooking!